Hey guys, Rude Dog Outdoors again. And I wanted to give you all a heads up uh, on this tarp that I've been using. I got this last year. Uh, and this tarp is... It's a Lixada, L-I-X-A-D-A. -A. Now I've actually seen this tarp come out with uh, a couple of different names on it and I've seen it with no name. The original one I bought actually had no name. Uh, I think it's it came from a company called Hyout, H-Y-O-U-T. Uh, came direct from China. I will leave a link in the description box below uh, for the Amazon store where I bought it. They now have, the Amazon store now has a larger version in some other colors, which I'm going to be looking to get later. But uh, if you can't tell by the camera, this is actually silver. This is actually aluminum or aluminized on the outside. It's uh, kind of a forest green. I don't know how well the camera is going to show, but it's a dark green. Uh, kind of a forest green, not definitely not like an olive drab or anything like that. It is not quite 10 by 10. It is a 320 centimeter by 300 centimeters. So it's not quite square, but it's square enough that you can do all that neat square tarp origami stuff uh, that people like to do. I have had this tarp up, guys. I kid you not. I took it down for the blizzard, and I took it down for one other really bad storm last fall other than that this tarp this one right here has been hung up since November I'm sorry uh, October I did take it camping uh, no actually no this isn't the tarp I used for that this has been here since October except for two storms that I took it down so it is held up tremendously uh, again aluminized on the outside uh, it's got taped seams everywhere, reinforced uh, tie-out points, the ridge line, I don't know if that's going to show up, but the ridge line here is taped and reinforced as well. It's got these hang points on top of the tarp, which I don't utilize. I usually put a ridge line up and put the tarp over the ridge line. Uh, we've got three tie-outs on each side and one to each corner so technically five tie-outs to each side and then uh, five across the ridge line counting the ends um, what I've been doing which I what I like to do I think I can show you better from this side is I'm running shock cord so originally I was running quarter inch shock cord Worked great, had no problems. I've only just recently switched to this 316th. Uh, I'm giving it a try. There's definitely more give, uh, but you know, so far it seems fine. Oh yeah, and what a reason I went to the uh, 316th was uh, I'm trying these these tent stakes out that came in a battle box, uh, quarter inch. Shock cord won't fit. What you do is you feed this through your, when it's in the ground, of course, you feed this through, tighten it up, you pull it into this. You can see that uh, cut right there, whatever it is. Uh, you pull it in there, then you come around the front, and there's two more. You pull it across like that. That's what secures it. Again, a quarter inch just wouldn't work. Pull it tight, snug it, pull it through. And I like these stakes. I'm just trying them out for now. So far I like them. I can't use pl plastic stakes in a lot of the places I camp though because the ground's too rocky. That's it. That's it, not much more to say, you know, it's a tarp. 
it's ripstop and it's held up tremendously well uh, I was using the AquaQuest uh, King Camo I had that set up on another part of the property and it ripped um, I can't figure out why it could have been a fluke could have been snow load but this didn't rip both were hung the same way over the ridge line uh, and then staked out the only difference was I, I didn't have that on the ridge line of the tarp I had it set back a little so that I could get it all the way down to the ground in the back and just had the front you know the front was shorter basically uh, anyway that's it I just wanted to let you know uh, again I'll leave links um, Lixada you can if you search for Lixada tarp uh, with those dimensions you can find it the lowest I ever saw it for was 25 bucks this the second one here I bought uh, from a store called Tom top off of eBay but it was only there for a short time it sold out pretty quick uh, I'll leave links for the Amazon store I did just see this same tarp on one tigress uh, a few of you may be familiar with one tigress there uh, been around about two years now and they've been coming up with some really interesting stuff I've got some other gear by them um, like comment share and subscribe and uh, that's it guys uh, hey get outside it's a beautiful day looks like that storm missed us see you later